Hey everybody, what's going on? My name is Klaus and thank you for tuning in today. Let's fix that rush. This is a tunnel 10 rush to count episode number 20. Uh, four, five, something like that. And we have our level 12 queen. We're going to put down to level 13 today. But I've got my Gigabarch army trained up. So let's go tear a base in half. And uh, the, the Gigabarch army, guys, wonderful strategy. I know you guys know it. I know you guys enjoy it. I love it. It's the best. Um, there's other strategies out there. Let me know in the comments how you farm your Dark Elixir. And I might even try it in the next Fix That Rush episode. Now, this episode, or this video, or this video come on this base is actually pretty good because what we're gonna do is we're gonna go straight at the base we're gonna use these walls as kind of like a funnel and we're gonna send in our goblins directly at the dark elixir and the town hall so with all that in mind guys let's throw down our giants just like so let's wall breaker in two breakers yeah that was awesome then we're gonna throw down a few barbarians uh, a few ga or no archers archers and then some goblins put the king and the queen down too but let's put down the goblins um i'm gonna heal i'm going to jump and then i'm going to rage and i'm gonna send in my goblins go buddies go go buddies go come on now yeah all right and oh man uh, uh <laughs> some massive clan castle action going on right now guys and we still got the dark elixir and the town hall what is up oh and the king almost died but we survived we barely hit that ability guys this was like a town hall did, did, did they have expos i don't remember it's like a tunnel 8.5 so um that's uh you know not difficult to take out but hey you know it is what it is and i'll put down our barbarians and our archers on this side too get them ahead of the goblins help them do some funneling and uh you know we'll we'll take out some more of the base not too bad i had some clan castle giants i could technically use them i think we could get the three star as long as we got these giants out let's uh let's heal over these goblins i didn't really need to do that i really expected there to be some some uh terrible things over there but there wasn't i really thought there was bombs but there wasn't so anyway <laughs> giants goblins everybody in tearing up the base what is up yeah i don't think we needed the clan castle troops either that was a dominating three star i guess it's expected we've got max troops but the gigabarts is not a three star strategy so i'm pretty impressed let me pop the queen's special ability and watch as the gold storage goes down through archers that was awesome tiberius i'm sorry so I'm sorry I did that to your base, buddy. But 400,000 elixir plus 2,000 dark elixir and a full loot bonus, 18 cups. Beautiful. Very nice. All right, so what about our second raid? I've got my armies ready. My heroes are down. I've got spells training up right now. Um, I really need my poison spell, too. That'd be wonderful if I can have my poison spell. Let me request. I'm going to wait till they get troops, finish up these spells. We're not going to go and use our heroes for the second raid. Actually, while we wait, check out the... Um, this, uh, I was using Barch before the video, actually. Check out this, this base. Tunnel 9, 400,000 golden elixir. I'm farming up elixir because I had my laboratory finish and I need to upgrade my balloons again. But I've also got tons of barracks and dark barracks to upgrade. So I'm like, uh, and I've got, uh, dark elixir drills to upgrade. So I'm like, dang, I need a lot of elixir right now. So I started a boost. I did some Barch and I accumulated a ton of golden elixir while I did it. So that was awesome. Maxed out my storages. I think I actually think I built a wall or two before the recording because uh, I really, really wanted to not max my gold. I, I'm, I'm, I'm bad about that. So put the king down, the queen down. We're going to grab the star elixir, and then that'll be it for the video. Pop the king special ability right now. There we go. Pop the queen. Now we don't need to pop the queen. She didn't take no damage. No big deal. And the loot, guys, combined over 700,000 golden elixir, uh, 350 each, basically. 2,000 dark elixir, a beautiful barch raid. I mean, loot's been weird. I mean, like when I first woke up and did my first boost, um, loot was terrible. Loot was great just right before I started recording. So that was awesome. I got a couple more minutes. So let's, uh, let's show one more. Uh, let, let's see. What's a good one guys. What's a good one. 2,499 dark elixir. I mean, how often do you find that much dark elixir barching? This base actually had 4,800 dark elixir. This base was gorgeous. Uh, but we just, we just didn't get it. So barbarians and arches everywhere. Ow. Uh, 
ow, I just hit my hand. That hurt. All right, so we got our Dark Elixir drill. We got uh, we got another one down here. Tons of barbarians coming for that, baby. And then there's another one up here. So all the loot that we ended up grabbing Dark Elixir-wise was in the drills. And then also the town hall was sitting right here. We got rid of it. So not so shabby. Not too shabby at all. We'll pop our, we'll throw down our king and our queen to grab the Dark Elixir out of this drill. Let me go ahead and quad time it four times the, the speed. Dark Elixir down. Pop the king's ability. Pop the queen's ability. And then cut it. I don't know why I held on to the... I don't know why I, st I kept the raid going. That was kind of silly. But I did get 50%. That's probably what I was going for. That two-star 50% so that uh, we gain more cups. Because what I've noticed, guys, is with this Tunnel 10 account, the higher up in the cups I go, which right now I'm in Crystal League 3, the higher up I go in my, my cups, the, uh, the, the more loot I find. So... Anyway, uh, dang it, nine. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and I, I didn't do that. All right, so let me let me uh, train up Gigabarch again, just like that, just to prepare. All right, let's go out and do another Gigabarch. No heroes this time, and see how much Dark Elixir we can lock onto. And we actually, I just remembered we three starred the last base. That was crazy. That was awesome. Shout out to that. If anybody's out there watching, if you're out there. I want to know you're out there, okay? So let me know in the comments that you're out there. Don't care what you say besides, uh, you know, I, I don't want random mathematical equations. Like, don't don't put random mathematical equations in my comment sections, all right? That'll be very upsetting. But uh, anything else is fine, all right? 4,000 dark... No, that's a little strong. <laughs> that's a little bit strong. Um, here's 2,000 with a good amount of gold in the elixir. Let's go ahead and hit this base. This is awesome. Loot is coming so quickly lately. All right, let's go right at the queen. That's the best plan. Let's go right at the queen. So let's send in our giants on either side. We'll put our uh, barbarians. Hold on to a handful. Uh, throw down our archers, just like that. Let's uh, wall breaker in. Let's put down our clan castle giants in the front. Let's poison spell the enemy queen. Put down our barbarians directly at uh them it her whatever and then what let's see let's see what we got the queen's dead let's see where the uh giant's gonna go next giants are gonna go in toward the base so let's jump the giants in let's heal the giants let's rage the giants and then send in some goblins behind because yeah that's what i'm saying i don't know what that meant but that's what we're doing let's uh heal spell into the core let's rage into the core we're gonna take the town hall did we miss any Dark Elixir? I feel like we, like, didn't even focus. All right, well, that's good. The goblins are going everywhere. We got some barbarians. We got some archers. Throw down a couple over there. Uh, that was probably bad, putting them over there. Giant bomb ruins everything. We had such a crew of goblins. Got destroyed. Oh, that giant bomb was the worst. The worst. But it's okay. You know why it's okay? Because I said so. Let's put down these archers. We're going gonna to grab this elixir. Come on, babies. Come on. Come on. What's going on back here? G uh, giants. Okay, cool. Oh, man. We ran out. All right. So we didn't get all the loot, but we got a lot of loot. We did decent. We did all right. Those giants got shot down. I think that's everybody. Everybody? Oh, that barbarian right there. Yep. Good job, guys. Good job. So we locked on to decent, uh, decent loot. Go uh, two hundred thousand gold, two hundred thousand elixir, kind of. Yeah, more than that because the loot bonus. I forgot the loot bonus was better, and over two thousand for the dark elixir. That's what we're gunning for, and that's what we got. So I, I don't mind that at all. I just don't mind. All right, so let's get the last of the gigabarcha going. We need to put a, we need to put a poison spell, just like that. That's just for future reference. Now, guys, I've got a ton of loot to spend. We got five builders that are sitting there chilling, and we have an idle laboratory. Now, this is the biggest. This is a cardinal sin of Clash of Clans. Okay, you do not let your laboratory sit and do nothing. Bad plan bad plan so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna upgrade our balloons level six so i think that means that they're max for tunnel 10 that's a six million elixir upgrade 10 days and then we'll be setting ourselves up for some laloon farming which is fun not saying it's gonna happen right now but it's good to be prepared you know what i mean so six million elixir three two one bam and a 10-day upgrade. It's going to take a long time. The original, uh, the level four, no, the level five upgrade we just did was five days. So 10 days is a lot longer. All right, so now we are out of elixir. How are we doing in the treasury? We got a million elixir in the treasury. I'm going to go ahead and collect that. 
Now let's spend a little gold. Um, I know for a fact, because of the Dark Elixir, I've got 65,000 that I need, and I have 84. So I got plenty of Dark Elixir to put the Queen down to level 13, so that's one builder. Uh, do I have enough Elixir to do anything in this lineup here? Um, 2 million for that Barracks. Uh, that one's 3 million, so that one's too much. That one's 1.75 million, able to unlock Valkyries. That would be kind of cool. Uh, Dark Spell Factory needs another upgrade, but we don't have enough Elixir. And then these Dark Spell, Dark Elixir drills are, are 5 million Elixir. That's a lot. Wow, 5 million. So that means that the only two things we can afford is this Barracks, unlock the P.E.K.K.A. Bleh, or we can unlock the Dark Barracks, level 3. That's with the Elixir. Do I want to do that? Yes, I do. Let's go ahead and get this Dark Barracks going. 1.75 million Elixir. Just working on our um, our offensive infrastructure. You know, the, the we need all these upgraded anyway. Excuse me. We need all those upgraded anyway, so you might as well do it. Next thing, guys, is up. So we got one builder taken. We got four left. That means we got three left. I'm going to do two gold upgrades, probably the cheapest ones. Air bombs. All right, let's do one. Let's do two. 1.5 million. Somebody mentioned something about these being maxed. I, I, I don't... Uh, oh, level four is maxed. Nice. All right. Well, let's move this baby out of the way and put him up here. Air bombs level four are maxed. That is awesome. So what does that mean? Does that mean... Do I have another one that's maxed yet? No. No, I don't. I can't see. These are going to max. I can move these out of the way. That's awesome. Dude, guys, we never get to move stuff out of the way on this series because we got so much work that we need to do. But this, this proves that we're making some serious progress on the base. Oh, man, this is awesome. All right, so that was cool. Uh, what about these skeleton traps? Oh, they're, they're maxed too. All the skeleton traps are maxed. I remember somebody in the comments yelling at me because of that. So um let's let's go ahead and let's go ahead and put these skeleton traps out of here too let me back up make this a little bit easier oh i can't click it there we go move the skeleton trap out of the way guys everything we move into the maxed section of our progress base is just like a, a victory man it seriously is a victory that is awesome what about these seeking air mines they're all level one they all go to at least level two so we don't need to do that these still have uh we need yeah we get two air bombs left what about the spring traps they're all level three they have another upgrade for sure uh bombs go to level six for max so we got a long way to go for that what about the giant bombs they go to level four and uh we got a long way to go for those as well so y'all were right air bombs and skeleton traps were maxed that's awesome i'm still doing the cheapest gold upgrades that i can while i'm trying to get my my walls to level eight it's such a struggle guys but it's okay it's all good so last upgrade guys actually wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute treasury treasury uh 625 wow okay awesome so that means that the last gold upgrade we're gonna do is 1.5 million that means that we're gonna be able to spend three 4.5 million on walls that means that's nine walls so let me go and take that out one two three four five six seven eight nine and move the further one down 4.5 million gold on walls right here three two one bam yeah all right so then last but certainly not least for gold is the final air bomb so we'll go ahead and start that one and move it up to the top guys that is a great feeling seeing things finally going up into the max side of our progress base um seeing a little bit less clutter down here on the bottom is absolutely awesome too bad we didn't get to do any defenses but traps are low war weight and useful especially air bombs i mean air bombs are great against balloons right we want to defend against balloons they're like the meta right now so that was awesome last thing guys is dark elixir queen level 13 65,000 dark elixir in three two one bam victory all right guys so that was a productive day got all five builders rolling another queen upgrade laboratory going maxing our balloons for down 10 and one step closer to finally getting to war with this account which is gonna be it's gonna be crazy that's gonna be surreal but either way guys we got a long way before that's gonna ever happen so we might as well just enjoy the grind while we are at it but anyway guys that is it for me i love each and every one of you please like the video if you're liking it if you like the series if you want to see it continue then let's uh let's get this video to a thousand likes that's that was my that's my goal thousand likes for this video to see this series continue also guys if you have not done so please subscribe and join that there klaus family we'd love to have you but anyway guys that is it for me i love each and every one of you and i will see y'all again
next time. Bye.